We randomly selected 800 citizens all over Europe. Uh, we symbolically said, say from the mountains to the islands, uh, from all corners of Europe, in order to hear their voice. And we have now four citizens panels, uh, which are debating on different themes. They are clustered. Today they are uh, debating on economy, on social affairs, on education, sports, digital technologies, and so on. So they are very important because we want uh, to hear what they say without uh, in being influenced by us politicians. We want uh, to hear what are their daily problems, what are their daily issues, what are their proposals, uh, what are their fears in the end. And uh, these recommendations, in the end, uh, will be translated into concrete conclusions, which will be handed over to three presidents of the institutions, Ursula von der Leyen, Roberta Metzola, and at this moment, uh, French presidency. Uh, die meisten Empfehlungen wurden angenommen vom Plenum, vom Forum, und ich bin sehr glücklich darüber. Einer unserer Erfahrungen, einer unserer Empfehlungen hat ganze 39 Prozent an Zustimmung gewonnen, bekommen. Ein sehr wichtiges Thema, äh, wo es um äh, umweltfreundliche Energie geht. Und das hat mich sehr gefreut, das Ergebnis. Well, it's the engine, I should say, the uh, engine of the whole. Uh conference because it is the citizens panels uh, who will produce what we call recommendations uh, to the conference and it's based on these recommendations of the citizens that we will define uh, the uh, reforms uh, proposals uh, that are needed for the future of you. I think Dubliners and Ireland can be very proud that this event is here given our history of citizens' assemblies and, and this venue in particular, Dublin Castle, has held many of our own deliberations and indeed has been the place of celebration for the referenda that have come out.